Well, good morning. Hello, Hello. there. Um, it is Saturday morning, August 1st. August 1st. It is August 1st. Um, John and I are celebrating our 10 year wedding anniversary, which was on Tuesday, July 28th. Well, he told me that he had a surprise for me, something that he was planning for our anniversary. It was supposed to happen last weekend. That wasn't possible. Mm -mm. So he said, you know, do we have anything planned next weekend? And I'm like, no, not that I know of. So he said, well, I have a surprise for you. Um, we're going to do something for our 10th anniversary. I'm like, okay, fine. Good. I couldn't think of anything. I've been racking my brain. <laughs> I have been racking my brain for at least a month on what are we going to do for our 10th anniversary? We can't go out to dinner because, I mean, yeah. where are we going to go that we're not sitting outside under Which a tent? Which is a similar problem I faced with some of the things that I wanted to do. Right, in in the heat and, and <coughs> you know, possibly a rainstorm or something. I'm like, I want to go inside of a restaurant and have a nice anniversary dinner, and we can't do that right now. So, um, it hit me literally on our anniversary it hit me what we could do and it's something that I've been wanting to try for quite some time and I know that John will love it um, so we actually just pulled up to the place without giving it away because I'll show you the sign in a minute um, are you my first words were oh cool yeah um, please surprised please and surprised excited I am excited because I've heard about this place. Yeah, I am going to turn you guys around so that you can see where we're at and um, then you get to come on this little adventure with us. Yeah. And this is where we are, Monster Mini Golf. I've wanted to try this for so long and John and I love mini golf and we're competitive and <laughs> so would you like to invite them to come with us? Join us, shall you? I like the clock here. Did you see that? Yeah, yeah. This, show. this is extremely cool. It really, really is. So we're in just waiting on our first hole. Two for you and a three for me. So dear, very cool so far, right? I'm enjoying it a lot. We're only on hole three and this is pretty amazing. It really is. So it's sort of like a, a graveyard slash Halloween type theme. Well, it's monster theme. Yeah, but it's... I mean, monsters are Halloween. But each one of them have, like, one of one of the um, locations has a Jersey Shore theme. Okay. I forget which one that is. Um, but it's still monsters, so it's very cool. Look at these right here. They look like um, their caskets like coming up out of the yeah. ground. I like the skulls. We'll get over that hole soon. So very cool. right now right there so we've made it to the corner over here where weird radio is um, and mr. skeleton hello mr. skeleton and look there's a bat hanging there a vampire bat he's hanging there's so much I mean this is literally one corner oh look at this dragon guys mr. dragon Very, very cool. I'm having a fantastic oh, time. Yeah. This is this is great. Great surprise, babe. Love it. This is such an awesome, awesome activity. I love it. So here we are in the one corner. We are at hole what, seven? Sure. No, what's it's on the ground over there? We're, we're nine. Hole number nine. Hole number nine right now. So that's the corner that we're in. Okay, in right in the middle of hole ten is this guy. That guy right there, playing the organ. It's 
pretty amazing. And where did my ball go? Okay, I hit my ball around the organ guy and I'm not sure where it is. Oh, you found it? Yeah. Oh, it's... It was behind this uh, casket here. Okay, so we're at hole 12 now and there's a spinner here. Um, hopefully this is coming through. Each player spins the wheel before his or her first shot and follows the instructions above the arrow. So there's a behind the back, bowling putt, uh, sorry, ace up your sleeve, topsy-turvy, blind putt, extra obstacle, behind the back when that's where we started. Okay, so do we want to do this, dear? Of course we do. Okay. Well. Ready? Here we go. I don't know what to hope for. Oh, it didn't go very well. Okay, blind putt I got. Attempt your first shot with your eyes closed. I can do that. Yeah, it can't be any worse. Oh, shush. I'm a pro now. All right. All right, so my eyes have to be closed. I don't know. Oh, maybe you can see it with that light. All right, so my eyes are closed. Did I hit it? No, you hit me, I think. No, I mean, I didn't know if I hit the ball. All right, so now John's going to spin the wheel. What'd you get? What'd you get? Extra obstacle. Choose an opponent to stand on the course as, as an extra. Oh, you and get I to get to choose, choose location. location. Okay. Well, then I guess I'll finish out my turn right. and then I'll stand in the spot. Perfect. Okay, so I have chosen the location that I'm going to stand in to be the obstacle. Ha ha ha. The hole is there. My feet are here. And the putter is there. And that's where his ball is. Good luck and may the odds be ever in your favor. <laughs> Someone didn't read it very well. Only for the first putt. Oh, really? Just well, for fun. I would have done the same thing. I thought it was the whole thing. No, just for the first putt. Apparently I must have cheated or something. I don't know. Okay, then I have to move. No. It's more fun this way. Okay, then I'll we'll do it. I'll put on the same thing. Okay. Oh! Good one. Oh, and if you're Walking Dead fans like us, in case you didn't already know this little factoid, you know who that is, right? If you're a Walking Dead fan, you know who that is. And that's your factoid, your Walking Dead factoid. Oh, 
was creepy. Well, dear, we have come to the end. To the end. Let's go see the Joker. The clown. Scary clown time. Hello, clown. So we just got done, and John beat me by like two strokes or something. Um, but yeah, so we're done with the um, mini golf. And we might hang around a little bit um, because the, the arcade is here and stuff. And there's like a laser room or something, like a laser maze thing. Um, and the, as you can see behind me, the restrooms are right here all the way in the back. Let me also turn you around and show you um, where the party rooms are. They have two party rooms apparently. And uh, it looks pretty cool. I really like the, the theming. It's pretty awesome. So here are the party rooms back here. And I guess they can also open that up to one whole room, which it looks like they have done. But it looks really, really cool in there. Look at the, the chandelier, the skull shop chandelier, which I think is on both sides. It is. They're pretty big rooms, and right now it is opened up into one large room. That's cool. So this is a really, really cool. And wouldn't it be fun to have some type of party here? Oh, look at over there. You can look up to it. Yeah, there you go. Two rooms, it looks like. Yeah. Wow, so there are two rooms, identical rooms, that can be opened up into one room as they have it now. Very, very cool. Look at the spiders on the wall over there. That's cool. So, dear, how was it? Lots of fun. Lots of fun. Um, are the bathrooms the glow too? No. I will say it was not very challenging, but it was very fun. To me... The atmosphere was great. To me, there was a little challenge to it once in a while. That's because she lost, um, obviously. No, but there is because there's a lot of turns and stuff. Um, but it's very cool. It's it so cool. It is very cool. And the atmosphere is fantastic. Oh, yeah, yeah, It's yeah. absolutely fantastic. Staff is real nice, too. Very, very kind. Very, very kind. Yes. Um, making sure you're having a nice time and everything. Yeah, they were they were really great. Um, so we're going to look around a little bit. You know you're old when you're in an arcade. And you look over in the corner and you say, That looks like fun. John wants to challenge me to this Nerf game thing. Where do you put... Oh, go ahead. Alright, so here I go. I'm going to try. Oh, I have to use both of them? No, you can use But I'm doing it and nothing's happening. I have to do this one? That was cheap. Yeah. Had I known I could have only used the one... We're, we're probably going to have to play again. Yeah, yeah. Get ready for Zombie Lagoon. That was Not quick. bad. 32 to 24. Spooky. Oh, okay. So there's a few different Everyone, rounds, it looks time like. Time is running out. Player one, round complete. You win. Very sure. We can play another round if you want. <laughs> All right. Well. Okay, so I won. I got ninety thousand seven hundred, and I don't know what your score was, but was, I won. It was sixty something. Okay, we are going to go vintage Space Invaders per my request. Although that Nerf game right over there, that was a lot of fun. It was. It was fun. It was just short. Very short. But it was definitely a lot of fun. Yes, like, a I could, lot of fun. I could um, be addicted to that. Yeah. Without a doubt. So we're going to do some Space Invaders. I, I'm Ski Ball Champion. That's my score there. That's John's. Yeah, she beat me. Okay, so we played two, two rounds so far. And John beat me this time, 31 to 26. I got exactly 26 again. So, uh... Now we get to a tiebreaker. Third round for the tiebreaker. Okay, third round. <laughs> 
and the tiebreaker. Again, that's me. That's John. I won. I am the ski ball champion. She is indeed. I love ski ball. Love ski ball. Okay, so we made it out alive. Alive we, indeed. Um, really fun place. I, I don't think that I really did a full like little tour, but it's not huge in there. Um, no. You definitely saw pretty much everything. Um, it was fun. We got to play. Lots we we bought the we bought the twenty dollar card for the games, and then you got twenty extra credits. So we were able to do what four, five, six, seven, eight, sort of, because only we were only able to do one player. So basically, because the laser thing was twelve credits for two people, um, you know, both of us did that. So. Yeah, like had we not done that, we would have gotten in like another three games. No, 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 more than that because the skee ball I didn't add in. Mm. So we did a lot. We did three rounds of skee ball. Um, so we Each. did a lot. Yeah. yeah, we did a lot on that twenty dollars. Yeah, um, I, totally worth it. Um, you just go to the the uh, kiosk and it'll give you the different options that you have. So. Um, we chose the $20 option and we got like 40 credits and we just went nuts and had a great time. Mm -hmm. Um, and golfing was Very fun. Very enjoyable. Yes, it was, it was. I am excited to try it again sometime. Without a doubt. For sure. Gotta bring the little ones with us. So. Yeah, definitely. We'll, we'll bring the kids out so then there will be five or six of us, um, which will jack the price up. Oh, speaking of the price, um, it was $12 for adults for miniature golfing and ten dollars for little ones um now if there was a sign in there if you're below this height you're free so i guess that would be like a two-year-old would be free i'm thinking um so but it was a lot of fun oh babe show them what we got we like, also yeah, we also that. made a purchase to um commemorate <laughs> our 10th anniversary celebration that one's mine the pink and john got the um the orange, orange the neon orange so we got monster golf shirts we got it's a very very nice quality shirt t-shirts were also twelve dollars it didn't matter what size they were twelve dollars they also had souvenir cups um that were four dollars or four fifty something like that um and they had uh basketballs with their logo on it that were like regular size basketballs and those were ten dollars each um, the shirts are 50% cotton and 50% polyester. It was a good time. Enjoyable time. It was time. a very good time. We do have um, part two of our anniversary celebration later because John has his surprise for me. It's nighttime now almost. It's like 8 o'clock or something. Um, we're in the car getting gas right now. On our way to... Wherever this guy drives <laughs> us to, I have no idea. It'll be interesting, and it'll be fun, and it'll be romantic. Okay. Yep. Have a good one. Thank you. Is there a nap involved? Because I'm getting tired. Hey guys, you're used to my wife leading these vlogs, and I usually or regale to like a comment or two, and yup up, and si say in the sidelines. Today, I'm leading the vlog and leading tonight's date. There are five special places, events in our relationship, in our ever-loving relationship that we have. One is here at Mc no, not McDonald's, <laughs> back in Shoney's where we first met. So to me, that's a very special place. Right. Where today, first, today it's, it's a, a McDonald's. McDonald's. The Shoney's is no longer there, but it's the same property. Same property. It was a Shoney's, it was a Friendly's, and it's a McDonald's. And across the street used to be a Wedgwood restaurant, which we've referenced before. That was a place that we worked together and hung out together and did some other things there, too. Yeah, which is now a, a little... Mattress plaza. It's a shopping plaza, plaza. now, oh, which gone. is horribly sad. Uh, Wedgwood closed yes. five years ago. We worked there for, what, almost two years something together? Like some, together. Something like that. Another key place that's very fond to me... Um, is where I proposed to my wife at Shoney, uh, Ruby Tuesday. Yes, which is also, which is also no closed. longer there. It's no longer there. <laughs> the building's there, the but building's it's closed. The building's there, but it's closed. Um, another place is down the shore where we, where she started the whole ball rolling with her and me. We were at the shore. She said, "Hey, babe," and we, we've been 
in love ever since then. Um, another spot that's real, real and deal to me is at the apartment complex where I used to live. There was a spot we would go, and it's the very first spot that I said I loved her, and it kind of threw her through a loop. Yeah. And it, to me, that that's where I wanted to do this tonight, but it is uh, overridden with weeds. There's a party going across in the field right next to it. The pool is open right there. There's a big dumpster there. It's just not going to work where I wanted to go. That's where I wanted to end up. Was uh, okay. I wanted to do a tour of these places, but this is really the best one here because Wedgwood in here to me and Ruby Tuesdays means the most. Yeah. But our final destination, thanks to my dad, is towards uh, Mount Holly. But this is my idea of a little romantic thing. Yeah. So those are the five spots that mean a lot to me. Half of them were closed. <laughs> but we're not closed. It's an ever opening chapter in our lives. A love chapter. That's so funny. Uh, we'll pick this up again at our final destination, I guess. So, this is the Rancocas Creek. There's a boat ramp over here. And there's a little boat just pulled in over there and they're unloading their passengers. So, you know, when you ain't got no money and everything's closed, you gotta be a little inventive and uh, I just wanted to take my wife out to a nice little picnic. That's just crazy. Careful with one right, of them. I so need... Alright, I see you brought cushions. I need a cushion. Okay. This That's... is too uncomfortable. Okay. That's why I bought them. This okay. One in Let's pause while I reposition my behind on a cushion because this ground is hurting it. Okay. My butt is much happier now. Well, I happen to be a big fan of crown fried chicken, so I got crown fried chicken. The other two things I'm actually pretty good at making but time didn't allow it, so I went out and bought some potato salad and an egg salad. Mm. And so that's what we have. And cool. we, I also have cheesecake from Crown Fried. Cheesecake. Look at her laid up on that. Look at her laid up on that. Cheesecake? From Crown Fried. So where did you get the potato salad from? Um, ShopRite. All right, let's 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 try it, shall we? So I got the egg salad and potato salad from ShopRite. What the heck? There's a bug crawling on the... <laughs> Did you guys enjoy that bug, whatever that was, crawling right across the lens? Alright, let's try this potato salad from ShopRite. It is it does look like good. potato slices. I had a bite of the egg salad, that was pretty good. It's not bad, it's very different. I'll say this, the flavor's good, but I don't know if I like the potato slice. Yeah. I like my potato salad mm -hmm. with potato chunks yeah. in it, like it's supposed to be. Yeah, but uh, Walmart, they were like, I mean, like, cubed, like, in quarters, rather, quarters. It was, but the, the flavor is good. Oh, yeah, the flavor I, is good. The, the flavor on that is good. All right, so now, what is it, egg salad, you egg said? Egg salad. It's a little too creamy, but it's good. It's got flavor. It's good, but like you say, it's very creamy. It's not... It needs little onion and celery more than it has. Well, any. and it needs more egg. Yeah, yeah, Like yeah. the mm -hmm. the egg chunks are too small almost. Yeah, it was like. <clears throat> I need quarter. some. I need some water. Now the other thing I brought. Uh oh, he has more things. I do. I brought some wine along. Wine <gasps> with and wine, wine glasses. glasses. Oh yeah, and somebody is shooting off fireworks. We can't see them, but we can hear them. Every now and again, one goes off. Oh, so what kind do we have? I have um, white zin, white zin, and moscato. Moscato. Oh, I know my wife. But are they corked? Look at the the wine sitting directly in front. Oh, my bad. No, no, that's fine. It was actually kind of a cool shot. I oh, came prepared. He came prepared. I got some chicken. I got some wine. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, 
Uh, a chicken leg just literally rolled off my plate. It ran away. It, it just, it just rolled. Cheesecake? What do you mean there's cheesecake? And wine. I have now switched to Moscato. To us, baby. To us. Ten more years. And more. Let's start with ten. Um, hmm. the mosquitoes are starting to bite. I'll have to take your word for it. I don't so, get bit by anything. Well, I just... It always hurt in the land. Nothing gets me. I'm yeah. allergic to nothing. Nothing affects me. Mosquitoes never bite me. I got one bite. So, we need to, uh, pack Baking. this up. We are done with our 10th anniversary celebration. We are indeed. On to another 10 years. Without a doubt. Many, many chapters behind us. And many, many more to go. Many more ahead. This is like, this is going to be a night I'm going to remember. It's yeah. not going to be a night that you're going to have to think, remember when? No, I'm going to yeah. remember this tonight. Yeah, we will remember our 10th anniversary celebration for sure. And I think yeah. that's what today really was about, was enjoying each other yeah. that we have for the last 10 years. Yeah, and it was, I mean, you know, that it was so me, much fun. just tells me how much more fun we're going to have in the years to come. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, many marriages don't make it past ten, let alone five. Mm -hmm. And we enjoyed today. I think this has made me realize that maybe we need at least every other month to go do something just by ourselves. Yes. So we're not going, you know, Paul, you can't do that. Paul, get back over here. Rachel, where's Rachel? <laughs> where's Rachel? Um... And I enjoyed the little walk down memory lane. Yes. Even though I saw it coming a mile and a half yes. away. Um, well, it was pretty Because, I mean, I know him. It was time alone away from the kids. And, I mean, we shared it with you. Yeah, yeah. But, um, you well, know. Well, we can put you on pause any time we want. That's right. Can't do that with the kids. That's right. I think we're, I think we're done. Almost. I think this is it. Now we're done. Okay. <laughs> so, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with us today. Indeed. We are Spencer's Ventures. We're going to see you in the next video. And we're out of here. Bye. Bye.